2016 marks the 100th running of the greatest spectacle in racing, the Indianapolis 500, also known as the largest single day sporting event in the world. As drivers and their sponsors prepare to kick off the racing season, one second genera generation racer is striving to make history. Graham Rahal, driver of the number 15 Stake and Shake Indy car, and he joins us right now to talk about why this racing event gets him so revved up. Graham, good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having me. So how excited are you for the start of the IndyCar season? I know fans are excited, but what has you so excited this year? Well, I'm, I'm extremely excited. I think, um, you know, for us to have Steak and Shake back as a partner with our team is a good step forward. Um, you know, the season is kicking off right here in St. Pete, uh, not too far away, and I'm, uh, I'm thrilled about that. It's, uh, it's a great event here, uh, family environment, a lot of fun. You know, I just think that there's a resurgence in, in open wheel racing in this country. I think a lot of people are paying more attention to us again. And the 100th Indy 500, uh, the 100th running, is, uh, is pretty special. I mean, you think about the amount of sporting events that have been going on that long. Worldwide, I think you can count them on one hand. And so, uh, you know, to, uh, to get the opportunity to be a part of that again will be, will be really cool. And, you know, the other part of that is it's 30 years on since my dad, Bobby, won the Indy 500 in 86. So be a good uh, tradition to uh, to keep on winning you know getting Ray Halls and Victory Lane there if we can. Right and I was uh, I was gonna say racing really does run in your blood uh, speaking to dad there who are your your prospects for the Indy 500 at, on the 30th anniversary of his win? Oh, I think everything's looking good you know I think we've worked very hard as a team uh, last year we uh, we led the series with six podiums two wins fourth in the championship uh, we we're right in contention in second going into the final race and unfortunately we got taken out by a competitor but uh, you know I think we're looking really good we've worked very hard uh, with continuity as, as an organization to not change too much and uh, you know we got to kick it off right you know right here in St. Pete though this weekend um, this place has been good to me in the past I got my first win here I got my first pole position here uh, in 08 and 09 back to back years so um, hopefully uh, hopefully we can get things going right this weekend and I'm so distracted because looking at you I'm just getting so hungry and it's because of Steak and Shake. You mentioned them. Talk about that partnership. They're doing some new menu items, too, uh, on the prize uh, freeze for the rest of the year, too, right? Yeah, well, down here in, in Florida, you know, the, uh, the black raspberry chocolate chip shake sounds pretty good right about now. Uh, I've been sitting in the sun a couple hours, so it definitely <laughs> tastes good. But uh, for those who, who haven't seen, the, the uh, prices will be frozen on the entire menu through 2016. So, uh, you know, make sure you go check them out. They've been a great partner of ours. We've got what we call a meet and eat, which is a little get together and a gathering later this afternoon up here in St. Pete. So uh, at one of the locations. So really looking forward to it. They've been a great partner of ours uh, the last couple of seasons. A meet and eat. I love it. All right. And as we close here, we we're talking about racing, kind of running in the family. How does it feel now to be uh, kind of a part of a power racing couple uh, on your new marriage? Congratulations, by the way. Well, it's good. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, my wife, Courtney, and I, it's definitely busy. Um, you know, we spend a lot of time on the road. Uh, be in Florida the next, I guess, week and a half. Uh, we race this weekend in St. Pete. She's in Gainesville next weekend. So uh, it's not much time off, you know. Definitely pretty demanding schedule, but a lot of fun. All right. We wish you luck out there. Thanks for joining us on the show. Sounds good. Thank you. For more on this segment, head much. to our website, fox4morningblend.com. How snazzy was that bow tie on his oh, suit? I loved cool. it. I loved it. All right, ladies, who's ready for a new handbag? Up next, a handy event that celebrates a woman's passion for a beautiful handbag while also supporting a great cause. Stay with us.